guys, Monique here. Just wanted to go ahead and get started in the social marketing uh, training. And so um, by now you should have done the, the uh, training in your back office. You should have created a schedule by now. You should have uh, maybe watched that YouTube marketing video. Um, and just going to go ahead and jump right into this. And before I do, I just want to mention that um, these are just uh, basically some of the marketing methods you can try to get your business going will it work for everyone probably not okay but you, you will find something that will bring some sort of response so if you find that that response you might want to just put more effort into that area of marketing because what works for one person might not work for the next YouTube um, might work for one person social media might work for another maybe advertisement might work for another or maybe just offline marketing speaking to people um so let's go ahead and get started and so first thing you want to do is you want to put up a post something like this to kind of introduce your business um just to put something up you know in case they're friends or people that you know you know other network marketers other uh you know business uh individuals might want to connect with you um, so something like that, like, oh, hi guys, I'm actually working now with an A-rated company. We offer a credit restoration service. If anyone's interested in getting their credit fixed, feel free to get in touch with me. Um, and then you want to put in your FES link right here. I actually use a domain that I purchased. Um, you don't have to do that. It's optional. The reason I did it was because I feel like the FES link, it's, it's great, but I feel like a lot of people are using it so if you want to kind of just stand apart from everyone then you want to try to make yourself you know a little different um, by getting yourself a domain so if you want to get a domain you can go on a website called 101 one and one dot com so that's one a n d one dot com and get yourself a domain okay um, once you get yourself a domain you now need to point that domain to your FES business profile page. Okay? So you're going to go ahead and get that domain set up, pay for it, do a checkout. They're going to give you a login. You're going to log into a control panel like this. And you're going to go ahead and click on manage domain. Okay? Just give it a second while that loads. Okay. So it's loading. And it's so good because it's only 99 cents, so you can't go wrong. <laughs> um, and you're going to edit the destination, okay? So let's edit the destination. You're going to click on this right here, redirect. And once you click on that, you're going to go ahead and paste your FES link like I have right here. There you go. Copy and paste. Paste it right here, okay? And click save. I'm not going to do that. Because I have something else going on right now with mine. Okay, I have my own website. <clears throat> That's separate. Um, so, yeah, so you did that. And so now when someone clicks on your link, it's going to take them to the FES page, your business page. All right. And that way they can um, <clears throat> check out more information on the, the product that you offer here, the FES okay so that's number one so now you made it known to everyone that you're actually in the business of repairing credit excellent um simple posts like this here are a list of some things we can actually help you out with um you want to put up just posts you don't want to sound too needy about anything um you know simple things of what we do you know here was a post i posted all these likes <clears throat> And so I have three rules to marketing on social media. And this was something I got from an expert marketer who has a lot of followers. There are three things you should be doing per day if you're going to be going with social marketing. Okay. Number one. Number one is... Excuse me. You need to um, pretty much you need to uplift. So you need to uh, 
um, you know, post things that are uplifting, things that are motivating. Uh, motivational quotes are definitely the thing. Motivational quotes. You can get that from anywhere. Go on Google. And look up motivational quotes. Motivational quotes for business. Business. Okay? And go to your images. Alright, because you want to build up that follower. And I'll tell you why, why later, why this will work out well with another marketing method. Yeah, you'll really begin to start to understand things a little more. Because everything, everything connects, believe it or not. So, um... Okay, so here's you know, one about entrepreneurship. Um, let's see. Success is some small efforts. Repeat the day in, day out. Here's a good one. So, thing like that. I probably would save. Right? And put it, save it as success. Day in. And go to Facebook, you want to just kind of post that. I'll wait for that to go. Okay, so you want to search success. Okay, I think it's under downloaded. Okay, one second. Let's put it here. So, success. Oops. Yeah, I think I'm not crazy already. Okay, I found it. <laughs> that was funny. Okay, so yeah, because you don't want to flood your your social page. You know, you don't want to flood it. Please don't do that. <sighs> um. So. You, you po you're posting something motivational. Okay, like I'm doing now. Let's see how it comes out. Yay. Okay, there you go. See? Okay, my computer's a little slow. Alright, so you're going to post something motivational. Okay, that's the first thing you want to do. Second thing you want to do is you want to post something educational. Something educational will be something like this that I posted. Okay, so that's a uh, clear example of something uh, educational. Here's a list of some of the things that we can do. Don't want to be embarrassed. Or you could post something like <sighs> looking for a few more agents to to my team and back to me for more details. Yeah, give us something like that. Looking for a few more credit agents to add to my team and back to me for more details. Um, no experience necessary. Oh, my spelling is so off. Alright, so no experience necessary. Uh, weekly pay. Right? And, uh, you know, direct deposit. So, uh, 
Um, this is something you can vote. So you want to post that? That's great. So you're either going to be posting something about the service, or you're going to be posting something about um, building your team. Um, then third, post something personal. All right. And personal, we need something that will attract the right crowd. Now, obviously, you're looking to to build your business. <laughs> so, let's just say, for instance, you were working from home, or you were out with friends having dinner. Right? Um, give me one second. I don't know why it's taking so long to load. Alright, so let's just say you were working from home. You would pretty much, you'll, you'll, you would get personal. You know, people want to see about you. They want to connect to you. Um, and I'll tell you why later on in our, in our later videos. Why it's important that you, you get a little personal. Especially if it's, um, if your method is social media for marketing. Um, so this is just an example. Obviously, you don't want to use these pictures. You, you want to use your own picture. <laughs> um, so here's a good example. You're home with the kids. You're working. You're making money. And you're going to spend time with the kids. So let's just say you got a good shot of that. Okay? Um, take a good shot and write something positive like, oh, it's, it's, um, feels good to work 100% from home. Don't put anything else. Make it really, really simple. You know, feels, it feels good, you know, to work from home. 100% for home. That's it. And add a picture. A snapshot. Okay, when you do that, it's called attraction marketing. You're connecting to people that, that want to know more information. They want to know what it is that you are doing. Okay, and once they, once they see this on a regular basis, three times, and don't do it no more than that, you don't want to flood your social, your social page. One, two, three. You don't have to do it all at once. You do one in the morning, one in the afternoon, one at night. Be very consistent every day you do this. This is social marketing. You do this on Facebook. You do it on your Instagram page. Um, I don't know what else you have. You have Snapchat. Do it on Snapchat. Twitter. This is something you have to be consistent with. There are so many people on Facebook right now that are looking for business. A business that they can get into. It's your job to connect with the audience. Alright, so this will be the end of our social marketing training um, if you have any questions, if there's something you didn't understand, feel free to connect with me. You have my email and you have my phone number. And I hope this was helpful. Thanks.